well, a standard if you've looked at the rhetoric of the administration from uh, April of 2000 uh, or March of 2003 until now, uh, there's been very much a shifting scale. Uh, I think the measure of success will be uh, in some sort of uh, functioning uh, society and, and some sort of minimal governance now in a country which primarily spends its time looking inward for a while and not uh, pestering her neighbors. Uh, and I think that's going to happen, but I must say I think there'll be a lot of suffering in Iraq for Iraqis. I feel that uh, you've had gasoline and you've had oxygen come together and there was a spark. And so you had conflagration. And this is going to have to burn itself out and that's going to take some time. Well, I think to the region, we have the obligation to redouble our own relationships uh, with them and try to make them as stable as possible. I think to Iraq, uh, we have to, having uh, started this, we have to try uh, to leave the situation somewhat better uh, than we found it. Uh, but at the end of the day, realize that this is an Iraqi problem, an Iraqi solution when it comes to governance. We can create the security conditions, which can allow them, if there's political will, to govern. We cannot govern for them, and at, at a point in time, we're going to have to make a decision if they're exerting sufficient effort on political governance. We saw recently uh, Ambassador Crocker and uh, General Petraeus came that thus far there's a lot of frustration in Washington and in Iraq with the lack of governance. Mm -hmm.